black and white, life and death, imagination and imagination X. It's up on the roof. Daddy, please. A midwinter's evening. A house like any other. They can't get in here. The windows are boarded. The doors are locked. Daddy, please. It's, sweetie, not now. This is very, very serious. But you have to let him in. Santa Claus is here. It's not Santa. Why? Be because it isn't. But, Dad, it's Christmas Eve. Two people. A family. Entered this day in expectation, even if their house was kept cold and their clothes were last year's. The tree was lit, the turkey was roasting, and Santa Claus was coming to town. But then... There it is! Daddy, don't! Get off of my house! He came. The story is... Up on the rooftops... Imagination X. Daddy, don't shoot Santa. Don't ever bump my arm like that. It's dangerous. But you are going to shoot Santa. L listen, I, I don't have time for this right now. Go to your room. No, I want to stay here with you. Then keep quiet. Oh, honey, I need you to be a big girl. I, I don't think it's Santa up on the roof. I, I think it's some bad men trying to get into the house. No, it's Santa. Honey, please. It if it was bad men, they, they just break through the windows, Daddy. Santa's on the roof. Stupid phone's still out. Don't be afraid, Dad. You've been good this year. Why would the phone be out? They must have cut the wires. Daddy! Honey, try and understand. I told you all about Santa Claus, but... Not, none of it was true. It's it's just a story. Then why did you tell me it was true? I don't know. I do, Daddy. You just don't believe anymore. Honey, Santa Claus Didn't is... Didn't he come when you were a little boy? That was Grandpa. Did you ever see him? We can't talk right now. We don't have time. You never saw him, did you? No, but I know because I've been Santa since you were born. The dollhouse last year that was under the tree... I put it there. But that was when you had your old job, right? They're close to the chimney. Daddy, you said we weren't going to have much of a Christmas because you lost your job. Maybe that's when Santa comes, when you can't get presents any other way. What are they doing? If it was robbers like you say, they wouldn't come down the chimney. They wouldn't fit. Well, maybe I... Daddy, just put down your gun, please. Uh, I stand back. Only if you put down your gun. All right, all right. I, I'm putting it down. Here he comes, Daddy. Here he comes. Just stand back. Go and see. Go and see him. Hello? Hello? <laughs> I'm sorry, Daddy. They come from far, far away. And they said this would be the easiest way for them to live here. Get away! Don't be silly. They contacted us first. Me and Beckett and all the kids in the neighborhood. They said if we helped them, they wouldn't hurt you too much. And we could have anything we wanted. Anything we wanted for Christmas. Please, please. I'm sorry, Daddy. What are they doing? They said this wouldn't hurt, and when it's all over, you'll be all fixed, and we can have a Christmas dinner just like always. Daddy, he says it would be better if I left the room now. I'll see you in a little bit. Oh, don't leave me. Don't leave me, please. <laughs> A 
a little house on a midwinter's eve, just like all the others. The Girl Was Played by Rachel Adams. Music by Brian Elsner. This is Jeffrey Adams. Imagination X.